Anonymous Watch Guy here with an unboxing video. Quick wrist check. Wearing the Deficiano Narwhal I featured on the channel here recently. Really awesome watch. But today I have a new release from New Zealand based micro brand Draken. And uh, this is my first experience with the Draken, and I am impressed with this watch initially. This is their new field watch known as the Iraqi. Uh, which is the Maori word for the tallest mountain in New Zealand, Mount Cook, which you see right here on the front of the pouch. It comes in this nice kind of nylon style travel pouch with some really good Velcro on it. And the inside you have this little puller and you pull that out and there is your watch. You do get a second nylon strap with this watch that is branded with the Draken logo there on the buckle. And then I'm going to take this off this little bamboo piece here. All right, I got it off of there. This does come with a bun style strap if you wanted to wear it on this bun piece. But you can also wear this leather strap as kind of like a leather NATO. And that's how I've got it configured right now. This is a field style watch. It's Draken's take on a, a modern take on a Dirty Dozen style field watch. Uh, there are several different versions of this watch. This is the Vector version. This particular version is currently sold out. I'm not 100% sure that they are going to get uh, more of these in stock. There is also the Flieger and the Milspec, Milspec variant that are still available. The Zulu variant and the Vector variant, as well as the Red Bar Special Edition, are all sold out. Again, not sure if Draken's going to restock them, uh, but you can still get a variation of this watch, and I would recommend picking one up if you are interested rather quickly. These are a smaller watch this is a 39 millimeter watch it is 46 and a half millimeters lug tip to lug tip you do have a 20 millimeter lug opening it is 12.3 millimeters thick its smaller footprint makes it look a little chunkier than it is you do have a flat sapphire crystal with inner and outer ar treatment on there Really nice crystal. You can definitely tell the AR is very well done. You do have a screw down crown here at the 430-ish position. Tucks away neatly down at the bottom of the case. It is signed with the Draken logo and that is also loomed. Does give you 100 meters water resistance. It is running the Miyota 82S5 automatic movement. Uh, with the small seconds complication, hacking, hand winding, uh, solid automatic movement on this one. And it is 399 US dollars. So really, really good price point on this one. This also has great loom, which you will check out in the full review video. Like the look of this one, like the uh, assembled in New Zealand down here in the chapter ring. I think that's a cool look. Very clean dial, very legible dial. Love the Draken logo. Really well done matte black dial. Like the circular pattern there on the small second sub dial. Very nicely finished 316L stainless steel. You do get drilled lugs, screwed in case back. Uh, and then on the other side, uh, the Draken branding on the side of the case, which may be divisive for some. Some people like it. Some people don't. I think it looks good. Uh, this is just the unboxing. Let's take a look and see what this looks like on my seven and a half inch wrist. And then stay tuned for a full review on this one. Here's the watch on my seven and a half inch wrist. You can see it works very nicely. This leather style NATO strap. Uh, nice branding on the buckle there. Where it's very comfortably, I'll also check it out on the nylon strap in the full review video. You can see there it is a little bit of a smaller watch, uh, but still nice wrist presence. Really like the look of this one. The Draken Oraki. Uh, if you like the video, give me a like, maybe subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned for the full review. Thanks for watching.